Welcome to Eric Blackman Music. Hi, and welcome to Eric Blackman Guitar. In this lesson, I will show you an exercise that I teach all of my in-house students that helps them to learn notes and chords. It's also a great exercise for learning to move between notes and chords. This is my major triad fingering and chord exercise guitar lesson. Let's start by talking about major triads. A major triad is the three notes that make up a major chord. An E major chord is played this way. I'm holding down the A string at fret 2, the D string at fret 2, and the G string at fret 1 and strumming all the strings. The three notes in that major chord are E, G sharp, B. Those notes can be found on the open E string, the fourth fret of the E string, and the seventh fret. So here's how we play a major triad melody. I'm using my index finger and my little finger to play those notes. Now this is true for every string. If I go to the A string, the A major triad is A, C sharp, E, and it's played this way. So you see I play the same frets. I'm going to go to the D string, and my major triad for D is D, F sharp, A. And there are the notes. The G string, G, B, D. The B string, B, D sharp, F sharp. And those are the notes in a B major chord. We're back to the high E string, and the notes were E, G sharp, B. So we want to learn to do this. If we go in the opposite direction, we'll go 7, 4, open, 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 7, 4, open. Now for our exercise, we're going to play the major triad on each string and follow it with the corresponding major chord, like E, G sharp, B, and an E major chord. And then we'll follow with our chord. We'll go to the A string and play A, C sharp, E, and follow with an A chord. And we're playing that A chord by holding down the D string, G string, and B string at fret 2, 
playing from the A string down. And that's A, C sharp, E, A chord. Next we'll go to the D string, D, F sharp, A, and follow with a D chord. We're playing our D chord by holding down fret 2 on the G string, fret 3 on the B string, and fret 2 on the high E, strumming from the D string. We'll go to the G string, and that's G, B, D. And we'll play a G chord. We're playing our G chord by holding down the E string fret 3, the A string fret 2, the open D string, open G string, and holding down the B and high E at fret 3 strumming all the strings. We'll play our B major triad melody by playing open B, D sharp, and F sharp. And that's open, four, seven, as before. And we'll play a B chord by holding down the D, G, and B string at fret four, and we'll play only those strings. That. That's an easy B major chord. Last, we'll have the high E. And we've already done our E chord. All right, so let's do our exercise. We'll start with the open E string. And then an E chord. The A string. A chord, D string, D chord, G string, G chord, the B string, B chord, high E string, and another E chord. Here we go. And if you practice that exercise for a while, you will know all of your major triads on the strings and the chords that correspond with them. Thanks for stopping by, and have a great day.